Hey everyone, what's going on? Jeff here from Films at Home, and today I'm back behind the camera to give you a quick look into this Columbia Classics 4K Ultra HD Collection Volume 2. For this video, I'm just going to do a quick unboxing, show you guys the packaging, talk about the different movies that are in this release, and kind of just give you a quick first impressions preview of this Volume 2 set. And then in future videos, I will be reviewing each of these 4K titles individually. So you'll want to be subscribed to my channel to stay up to date on all of that. But for today, we're just going to dive right into this set because this set has been one of the most anticipated releases of the year for many people. And we kind of knew it was coming after Volume 1 did so well. And Volume 2 has been out in the UK for a little bit, but it was actually delayed in the US and got pushed back. So it's had some delays, it's had some manufacturing issues, but luckily Sony was able to get me an early copy and I have it here to show it off to you guys today. So the first thing you'll see is that the artwork and the box is pretty standard to what we saw for Volume 1. So they're both gonna look good on a shelf together, although on Volume 2 they've gone with this sort of burgundy uh, red color for the box. You've still got different screenshots from each of the movies, the names of the movies at the bottom. We've got Anatomy of a Murder, Oliver, Taxi Driver Stripes, Sense and Sensibility, and The Social Network in this collection. So very, very similar all around. You get the Columbia Classics Volume 2 on the side, and then the back doesn't have anything, although it did come with the kind of J card. So if you keep those, it does have that. Now I usually don't keep them, just personal preference there. But it is very, very similar to the first set. Although I will say this one is a little bit glossier. It has a glossy look and feel, and it feels a little bit different than volume one, which was more of a matte. Uh, finish and so it has a different kind of look and feel to it. So now if we break this open You'll see here what's in the middle is we have the Columbia logo again and then we have the booklet uh, Which I'm gonna pull out here. So Volume one also had a booklet much like this. It has a bunch of quotes from different movies and then it dives into sort of uh, behind the scenes, essays on each movie, um, talks about the importance of each one, has some screenshots. So it's a pretty cool companion piece that we get here again for part two. And this one has, let's see, just about 80 pages. So lots of good stuff if you wanna read more about the movies and their importance and how they did back in the day transfers things like that all of that good stuff is in there so we still get that and i love the way this looks when it opens up now sticking with the left side here i like that they stuck with individual artwork and in individual cases for each release so here's taxi driver on 4k slide that open and you actually have some different artwork here so they all have slip covers which is nice then we've got oliver on 4k again slide this out and you've got different artwork on the inside although would you look at that this one got folded back and see i'm just opening this for the first time and this is mangled so that's not a good sign somebody obviously slid this on like that and uh didn't pay attention to how it wrecked the slip cover so that's disappointing um, and then we've got anatomy of a murder again with the slip cover and this one looks like it's in good shape looks like they're going with sort of the original like poster art for the uh, inside covers and then some new artwork for the outside so that was a little disappointing just the fact that that was completely ruined i mean not only was the case ruined and ripped and the plastic was ripped but even the artwork on the inside was ripped so I'm gonna have to contact somebody about that because it's not even like I can put it in a new case. The artwork is ruined. But moving on to the next side, we've got the social network here. And then again, original poster artwork. This is pretty much what we were used to uh, for social network. We've also got stripes on 4K. Again, original poster art, more classic artwork on the inside with the new artwork on the slipcover. And then we've got sense and sensibility. Here's the art on the inside and the slip cover. So the other cool thing is these all have sort of like a um, review call out. So this is rapturous romance, laugh out loud, funny, um, a celebration of all that is reckless and foolhardy, an American landmark. Like it, it, it captures different um, 
review comments from from each of the movies which is kind of nice that kind of keeps with the uh, historical theme and I, I do like that they stuck with all individual releases because you know I think it just makes for a much better package and it's much more secure for them each having their own case than doing something like uh, sleeves or something cheap like that. Now this release also comes with a digital copy for all six of the movies you can redeem in 4k so that is available and then there are a lot of special features which are covered here um, on the J card but there are over 30 hours of special features there's um, an exclusive bonus disc blu-ray disc with a ton of short films from the columbia pictures library again that's a really cool feature they don't really talk about that was in volume one as well but this has 20 short films from the columbia pictures library so i love that they include that and then most of these actually have dolby atmos i was just looking taxi driver is the only one that doesn't have dolby atmos and then taxi driver has dolby vision as well as the social network and the rest just have hdr 10. So overall, I think this is another pretty nice release from Sony. Um, this Columbia Classics line is certainly one of the most premium 4K box sets that, that you can purchase. And this one, interestingly enough though, it is a limited edition, so it'll definitely go out of print at some point. But they haven't mentioned what the print run is, and I haven't been able to find that out. We knew what the print run was for Volume 1. We don't know for Volume 2. Personally, that makes me think like maybe they printed more, but you just never know when this thing's going to go out of print and it will because volume one sells for crazy money now. So if you do want to grab it, I would recommend grabbing it soon. And, you know, if this drops to say $99, that's probably a good sign that it's about to go out of print and they're getting rid of the last bit of stock because that's what happened with volume one. So that's it for the video. Just want to do this quick unboxing, show you guys what's in here, talk a little bit about what each of the movie offers and, and what this set's all about. But I think this holds up with the, with the first volume set. I actually think that it maybe is even a little sturdier because my volume one set has that matte finish, but some of the corners got really banged up and I'm actually seeing that this is in a little bit better shape. Although super disappointing that that one disc came completely wrecked. So I'll have to reach out to Sony for a replacement, but knowing them shouldn't be an issue. They've been very good about that in the past. And so far I'll have to dive into each of these, but I haven't heard of any errors with missing bonus content or anything like they had on volume one in Lawrence of Arabia. So that is also a good thing. So if you're interested in picking this up, I will leave a link for you guys to order it down in the description. If you order with that link, that helps support my channel. So I'd appreciate that very much. Um, lots of you have already pre-ordered it as well. And so if you're interested, stay tuned because I have 4K reviews coming for all of these. I'm probably going to dive right into Taxi Driver, Oliver, and Anatomy of a Murder first. And then cover the second side with Stripes, Sense and Sensibility, and The Social Network. I think that those are kind of the second tier. And these movies are the first tier of this set. So... I will dive in and do all six of those reviews, so make sure you're subscribed and uh, have your notifications on so you know when those go live. But just want to say thanks again to Sony for sending this early, letting you guys get an early look, and giving me a head start on the reviews so you guys know what to expect when this one arrives for your collection. So thanks for watching. That's it for the video. Um, I'll definitely have more reviews coming, lots more 4K. Like I said, I got these six. I got more from the Universal Classic Monster set. I got the Halloween 4K movies coming in soon. All kinds of stuff. I actually just got the Green Knight as well. So I have reviews to do up the yin yang, but I'll get them all done. So stay tuned for all those. Make sure you follow me on social media so you can stay up to date with all the latest on the channel and what's going on in my collection and my life. Those links are down in the description. And other than that, yeah, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Super excited to check this set out. I hope you guys are as well. And uh, yeah, stay safe, stay healthy out there, and I will talk to you all soon.